I'm up here today to go ahead and pay for the rep. Damn, P. Glow, you did that. It's your boy Real to Real man back in here with another video. Hey man, say man, hey man, it's your boy man. Real to Real, y'all already know what it is, man. Let me turn on this air because it's man, it's so hot down here in Texas right now. Like it's extremely hot. Let me make sure ain't no heat on. I'm talking about when I say extremely hot, it's it's extremely hot. So, um yeah, first thing first, man. Uh, we starting off the day. Make sure y'all get y'all tickets right now for the 2020 C8 Corvette 3LT Z51 package. You feel me? Make sure y'all do that. You know what I'm saying? Do that ASAP. And make sure you guys, if y'all have it, man, hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel. Join the real gang. You know what I'm saying? We on the road to 150K. And uh, we definitely gonna get there this year, man. That's one of my biggest goals for this year, is to hit that 150K. So if you guys haven't subscribed yet, take out your phone, subscribe, get on your TV, subscribe, don't matter what, subscribe. Get on your radio and your car, subscribe, just like me. You feel me? I can subscribe to people's channel from my radio, you know? But we got that big boy Tesla screen, you feel me? So first thing first today, man, we on our way to Omar's wheels, man, so we can take off this wheel and get that wheel sent off, man, and repair it, because it is on the warranty, because it is, the clear coat is peeling off of it. It ain't from no curve, whereas it ain't from no potholes, nothing like that. It's just, the clear coat is just, it's coming up. I guess it made a, um, it, it might have messed up once I changed over the tire. If you guys didn't know, um, I changed that tire before, and, Damn, I almost seen a wreck. I almost seen a wreck happen. Just that fast in front of me. And another thing, man, happy birthday to my mom. Uh, definitely, definitely appreciate you and love you to death. Y'all always see her down in the comments. Yes, she's always in the comments, every video. But um, definitely want to say happy birthday to her, you know. And um, I got to... I got so much stuff to do, you guys. I just don't be having a lot of time. I know a lot of time people be wanting so much action in my videos and all this type of stuff. And um, y'all gonna get the action. The thing is, you gotta be prepared for the action. You gotta pay for the action. And I ain't rich, <laughs> so whenever the action comes, the action comes. But I'm always putting out content my stuff will never be dry and boring. Sometimes I have to talk my shit. I have to because I ain't finna let no people run over me. I ain't finna let no subs think they, or whoever they is, people that don't support me and just be talking, I ain't finna let them think they got the upper hand on me and because they don't, you know what I'm saying? So, uh, yeah, sometimes I gotta address some stuff. And if a lot of people don't like my cursing and stuff like that, bro, I'm me. I'm real to real. I'ma always be me. I ain't gonna never change myself because of nobody. If I get an editor, I had an editor uh, edit the cursing words out. That's just it. I'm not finna try to make myself sound highly go lucky just to please one or two people that don't like real to real cursing. Like, come on, bro. If you grown as hell, act like it. See, you grown. Shit, you act like you ain't heard a curse word. Curse word is a made-up word. Who said it is a curse word? 
Somebody had to make up the words, right? I can say, Retava. Damn, that's a curse word. And just put it in the book, say that's a curse word. God damn, it's just words. I'm just talking. So sometimes just listen. Shit, everything ain't <laughs> like, I don't know, man. I don't know. Some people just, it, it trips me out, man. But, you know, when you grown, shit, you just sit there and listen. Because it might be some a point in there that needs to be put across that you might miss out on because you don't want to listen. But, like I said, man, we headed off to Omar's wheels to get this wheel taken off. I just, I guess he's just going to um, put the spur on and... I'm going to have to just take it to the house and park it. I was trying to go get the stuff done for the dunk today, but I don't think that's going to happen because if y'all don't know, man, Omar's Wheels is like an hour and something from me, so it take an hour and something to get there, an hour and something to get back. By that time, shit, it's going to be like 5, 6 o'clock, and I'm not going out to film no more. Like, it's... Bro, y'all don't even understand. Like, the inconvenience of going to a shop, you know what I'm saying, like, it's so fucking inconvenient, you know what I'm saying, when something mess up, and you gotta take something back, and you you had all the stuff planned out, or, you know, on your agenda for that day, and it's like, you'll never get the stuff done if you procrastinate and don't do it, so, I just said, forget it, today I'm gonna go ahead and do it, I supposed to took the scat over there, to put the spacers on, the um the hub centric space is on and I ain't got to do that yet. Then I gotta drop the Corvette off the car to car because I got an event I'm going to this weekend. I ain't done that yet. <laughs> I supposed to be taking the um the don't to get the safety inspection done so I can put the tags and everything on it so I can get so I can move it around or or get out and make content with it before it go into the shop. I ain't done that yet. So Y'all, we be busy, man, and it ain't all happy-go-lucky, all we happy doing this, we in the streets cutting up, all that, you know, I'm still fighting a case too right now, you know what I'm saying, so, I'm never gonna be at ease, and I'm always, I, I gotta send money to lawyers, I gotta do this, I gotta do that, you know, I gotta make sure this straight, you know, so I can keep driving, all this type stuff, so. Man, it's just, it, it's a lot. It's a lot, y'all. It's a lot. It's definitely a lot, but we're going to get through it. And, bro, I ain't complaining about it. It's the life I chose. It's the life I asked for. I, I, people I always can say what they regret and what they regret this and that. Me, I don't regret nothing because it makes you stronger in life. And um, if you can find a way to get through it, get through it. That's that's all it is, man. We just got to keep moving forward. We can't, the past is the past. Yesterday is yesterday. That shit is gone. Today is a new day. Let's get up, go get it, and I'll catch y'all when I get the old Mars wheels, man. Peace. Salam alaikum. Alaikum assalam. My brother. <laughs> <laughs> My house club <cloth> banda. <laughs> right. Yeah, bro, the, with the wind, it's making it worse. The wind is making it worse. Oh, I heard. Worse, it's only though. this wheel? Yeah. I just have to put my uh, spare on that's in the trunk. My boy, did you check? Nope. Yeah, the dunk wheels. He said he was gonna call me. The nigga didn't never call me, bro. What happened? Something happened. Ain't nothing happened. No, something happened with me, my personal shit. You made me forget. Well, I can't what forget happened? today. You know what happened? I woke up and I forgot. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. You're so worried about the 43 eggs. Yeah, I got that hold up. That's why I'm this nigga right here. What 43 eggs? Huh? You got him a little block. 43 X? What's that? Oh, you're talking about the. Oh! Whatever it's called. Hey, what's going 
go to the store. It go to the it go to, into the shop next week. Yeah. Damn, shit got No, no, bro. No, I was I was actually talking about the wheel and plus the dude said he couldn't do the uh the the flex fuel shit that I wanted. You know, I was trying to do the flex fuel with the E85 so I can get the whole 4,000 plus horsepower. So now I'm gonna be stuck around the 900 something range with the 93. I'm just gonna get Matt to do it, bro. I ain't gonna even Go back to them. It is what it is. Matt down the street. I'm gonna get him to do it after they get done. Cause I already paid them 75%. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, you hear that? Big, big, oh, wine. That's that fine wine, my boy. That fine wine, huh? That fine wine. Have a little wine with my, uh, with my cheese, my boy. Just don't know how to act, bro. Can't give you nothing. You, you can't do no burnout. It's over. <laughs> Unless we take the fuse out. What's up, bro? <laughs> chillin', chillin'. Yeah, unless we take that fuse out. Who got that pearl busting on that thing? Ooh, look at that pearl. Y'all don't see what I see. You feel me? They don't see what I see. Hey. Hey, I'm gonna bring the scat tomorrow. I'm gonna have to bring it after I drop my Corvette off to go get washed, cause I got an event to go to. I'm gonna put them, them spacers on. Oh yeah, yeah. Yeah. Cause I don't want to mess with taking them down. What's it called? Them floaters off. Yeah, hell yeah. Hey, I heard a lot of people tell me I need to probably put some Loctite on on the um uh, what you call so the faces won't come off. Yeah. So when I, yeah, I'm gonna buy it and I bring it up here. Yeah. Got the twenty eights on that thing. Huh? I think they're gonna send a whole new wheel. Why would they send a whole new wheel? They said I'm gonna send you another one, so I'm guessing they're gonna send a whole new wheel. Or a lift. They probably a lift. A whole new wheel or a whole new lift? One of the two. I got you the It's probably a lift. Got me done quick. Uh for y'all gonna send me another barrel. Or whatever. You feel me? Huh? <laughs> Head ass. <laughs> Where? I don't. I like Will by Wade, Will. Huh? You said it's bent? American Force on what? Say zero. That's five by five. Five by five. Let's see. Let's see, let's say, let's say. Man, ain't it? This shit, I thought I, I had a hoodie on yesterday so I wouldn't get sick because it went straight from a little bit of cold to hot. Really hot. That's that Cali weather. I know, right? Cold in the morning, hot in the afternoon. Dang, that is it. That's here. Dang, bro. That's here, bro. Ready to go. What? Let him finish off with the info on it. I say, just make it happen. Mm -hmm. I know, but shit, I don't want to cut on the car. If that was a six right there, I probably would have went on and snatched it up. I gotta find another wheel that finished. 
That Magnia. Right there. No, heck no, that's ugly. My boy, that's brown. That's copper. That's not rose gold. Huh? What this? Yeah. For what? That's a twenty-eight. Oh no, they don't give him some bro. No. You, well, you stuck on twenty-six, huh? Yeah, I'm stuck on twenty-six for the donk. That rose. I told you it's a sin for people to go twenty-eights. They gonna talk about you like you just put some roaches on your stuff or something. <laughs> Let them talk. I know. I'm on the talk, bullshit walk, right, real? That's the model. <laughs> you that's the plan, my boy. No, that's all. But this, this the wheel. No, so that wheel different, bro. Don't order that other one. This the wheel right here. It's the wheel, my nigga. That's For real? That's a 20 inch wheel. It's a small wheel. Oh, so this, it's more of this. Yeah, on it. bro. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was like, hold on, bro. That might look a little different. It's the same wheel, bro. It's the same one. Okay. Same I'll wheel. Go. Huh? Same one, I'll go. Why you keep trying to sell me all 22. this crazy that's stuff? Here. 22, that's a 26. No, the here, no, because if it's here, then it got a small lip on it. It ain't got no big seven lip. Inch. Yeah, they don't got seven inches on it. I want seven inch lip. This is for a track called Ka Baby. It's not gonna fit. We can no, put those on the track. Will, but it needs a seven inch. It doesn't have it. Yeah, that's for that's, that's for a track hog, my boy. Yeah, you trying to? Huh? I see the one over there all go. They already said it. Oh shit! I'm like, huh? No, I do want to wait for what I want my donk to look like. The the donk is a car that you wait on. Shit, because the thing is, hell, I gotta I gotta put the big big suspension kit on it, the brakes, the rear end, the motor in it, everything. But my shit running dry right now. I can drive that bitch all the way over here. I was fed to today. But I was like, I gotta bring that. I gotta bring the other car tomorrow. I got too much stuff to do. Now you need to drive that bitch on the weekend when there's no traffic. Oh, I'm pulling it out this this week for sure. I'm definitely doing that for sure. Then you got a Magnia up there. That's a 24. That's not a Magnia. Twist it. Uh -huh. Magnia twist it. Oh, over here. I thought you were looking at that one. No, I'm looking right there. Yeah. Magnia twist it right there, my boy. You Magnia. blind, my boy. Magnia. Magnia. Magnolia. 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 <laughs> Them for charges though, ain't it? Now that's for a motherfucking uh, for That's a G body. That's a G body. Yeah. Hmm. Too bad I ain't got no G body, but one. But one. But one. But three, maybe four. I always had two for some reason. Now, <laughs> well, not two, but. It either been a box Chevy or two box Chevy. We've always had a couple just off camera, guys. See, I know. Y'all think we beef with each other? <laughs> Why you keep bringing that up every video? They don't know what you even... They don't even remember that half the stuff that go on until it happens that, on that video. They don't remember nothing, bro. They don't even hey, remember. You ain't even the guy that works 20, at, I know, right? at, at nothing. Twenty-two Nowhere. by twelve AG Pro Four is new design. They just came out. AG Pro, it? who? I'll ask your boy AG Pro. That's my boy, shit, bro. He's out here. AJ, you know AJ wholesale. Wholesale. That's his brand. I'm probably going with JTX on my my new dually, my boy. Yeah, boy. You know who's the JTX? Right, your boy right here. Oh, well, I'm just going to call them myself and, um, you know, talk over some business. You feel me? <laughs> oh, damn, that Porsche just left. Damn, I was trying to record it for them. Because I, I believe that is the car that they wrapped. Good. What size is it? Check, 37. What, what, what? Oh, uh, what's your car going? Hold on. Cause he still didn't give me the price on them damn sixes. <laughs> Hold on, let me see which one. <laughs> I'm still going sixes for Rick Ross car show, so. If he gotta redrill them, I'm gonna have to redrill them regardless. No swirls. I like them. I like them, but that's a 24, that's a 26, 
Where the mother ones at that I had to choose from? Yeah, so that's 26. Uh, that one. I don't know. I gotta choose between one with one of these because they gonna be here. Ain't nobody coming in here buying them too damn fast. Oh, I thought about these too. Thought about them too. But what if I wild body it though and go with these joints though? Oh shit! All right, y'all. Omar and them got everything that they needed. I'm waiting on him to give me a call back about the dump wheels, cause he said them people behind at the Cromer and stuff like that. So, um, and they can't even find all his orders still. So he got to call and check on them again. They gonna he gonna give me a call back. So I don't know you guys. Um, but at the end of the day, bro, I can't I can't really. I can't rush it in a way because you got to think about it, bro. I still have to do the motor. I still got to put the big wheel suspension kit on. I was trying to head down here to Matt's shop to see um, was he back in town, but he's not back in town. So um, I still got to, I just got a lot of stuff to do, man. I was trying to knock out the safety inspection stuff for the don't, but I don't know how that's going to go. So. I don't want to have to keep coming down here and wasting all my time um, out the day and knowing I got to get you guys hunting this guy. So, making a big U turn and um, I'm going to just head on out, man. I'll cut back on the camera. One hour later. Alright, y'all. So, uh, damn, what's that in the back of there? All right, y'all, so I'm supposed to, um, I'm up in the garage right now. Um, so I know you guys been waiting on your boy for the actual colors content. So, um, here you guys go. Like, we finna start on that bill also while we doing the 75. Because it's like I'm getting pulled so many different ways, bro. It's like, um... Stuff ain't, ain't just going as planned, um, which I ain't gonna say it's not going to plan, but um, I gotta keep the content going. And I just think it's that time for us to start knocking out stuff, bro. Cause you know, stuff ain't gonna get done unless I just go ahead and start um, getting everything knocked out and everything squared away. So y'all know we still, we waiting on Matt to get back from vacation um, for his birthday. So happy birthday to my guy, Matt. I told him if I ain't seen him, I need to let this top back up on the vert too. So one of those spiders and all that stuff get in it. I don't think they is, but just to be on the safe side, but hell, it's gonna be in paint shops and all that type stuff. But um, yeah, just got off the phone with uh, a guy named Bezo. So uh, shout out to him. He got a YouTube channel. And all that stuff, he trying to grow it, grow his YouTube channel and uh, get out there, man. He just did a, a 76 dunk and um, he's a paint guy. So literally just got off the phone with him right before I picked up this camera. And, uh, you know, I'm going to let him get his hand on this uh, 72 vert, man. Uh, definitely going to do that. So I was going around and I was showing him every little thing that was wrong. Like I told him, like, I'm going to show y'all too. Like, I don't try to hide shit. Uh, got a little crack right here. Got a little crack. One day, my wheel, I think, fell over and um, hit it. So, you know, that just <laughs> got so many wheels beside it that would have happened. Then, so as y'all see this right here, how it go from open into closed. Right there. So, what I'm thinking is... Somebody hit something on this side. So if they can be pulled back out, then I pull it out. Cause I'm thinking it's just uh, push itself in the the bumper bracket, push itself in. So I'm thinking it can be adjusted and come back out, rather than me having to replace it. But if he say I just need to replace it, then I'm gonna replace it. But 
the bumpers are kind of still new or whatever. But I'm gonna show you guys this too. Like, yeah, I gotta show y'all the good, the bad, the ugly. Let me get this plastic out the way. No cracks in my windshield whatsoever. You know what I'm saying? But it gonna need buffing out my windshield. I'm gonna try to get it buffed out and everything like that before it go back in. We got this little rust right here, right here. And a lot of these 72s come with that type of stuff on them. So, you know, you can't really just get away from that. Like I said, this is a good solid body car. Uh, it is a up north car, a Chicago car. Then it got the little rust right here. So he already, we already talked to him. We discussed uh, him redoing that, uh, making sure it ain't nothing else hidden. Go through that. Um, he gonna do the floor pans in here too because um, the driver's side need a floor pan because uh, it got little holes in it. Got little little holes in it, but I don't want that to come through, even though it probably could be surfaced. And well, it's not surface once it goes in. And once it goes through, it's automatically canceled. It got to be cut out, or it's gonna keep spreading. So we ain't even going. We're not even gonna deal with that. We're just gonna cut it all the way out and just redo that that piece of the floor. And our, the rest of the floor is all good. So we're gonna do that. Then, uh, like I was showing them, this probably like the only little ding that's in it. Uh, plus, no, it's one on the other side because. I think the paint chip, when that radio fell, man, that radio had fell and went up under my tire. Yup, and it hit right here. But that ain't no dent or nothing. It's just chipped the, the paint on it right there. So, and it's just a little bit of waves up in it. So we got to take care of that. Y'all know this hood coming off. So if anybody need a hood, I'm going to be selling it after I get my new hood. So it's my new hood here, the 442 hood, that's going to go on. You know what I'm saying? We're going to keep the rally stripes. And like I said, it's just an all around good, good, solid car, good body or whatever. Like, it's just a real, real good solid car. Got this little on it. That's just like a little chip in the paint or whatever. But uh, all this stuff right here is going to get replaced. All this stuff, I think you can buy brand new. So we're going to just replace all that. Um, if he tell me, no, nah, don't replace it, color match it. Because sometimes these do look good when you color match it. Because these come out of the bumper. So you can color match it the, the color of the car. So I don't know. We'll see how that, that probably work out. If it look good, it look good. If it don't, we'll do it some other way. You know what I'm saying? Then y'all know we're replacing the top on it. Um, we're either going to replace the top or we're just going to get the top re rebuilt. And refurbished like I'm doing this one. So if the guy said no, you ain't got to replace the top, I ain't gonna replace it. But the only reason I was replacing the top is because when it got shipped down here, it's right here. Got a, got a gap in it from the guy shipping it. So yeah. So what we gonna we got on the agenda today is to get this joint crunk. I don't know how I'm gonna get this hood up. Um, the hood ain't been trying to come up for me. And I done did everything that I can to try to get this hood up. And it just ain't coming up. So hopefully this joint is just out of um, gas. Hopefully it's out of gas because this was a running and driving car. And hopefully it's just out of gas. So I'm going to go up to the gas station, go get some gas. And then after that, we got to take the Corvette off to um, Carter so it can get washed up. So, yeah, I'll catch you guys in a minute. And... Yeah, stay tuned, man. We gotta get this joint running and driving. Once it get crunk running and driving, I'm gonna hit the guy up. And uh, I don't know exactly the exact date, but we're gonna head and we're gonna take this joint onto uh, the painter guy. You know what I'm saying? So he can go and get started on it. Ain't no reason to just sit it in in the garage, be holding it up. At least I can get the paint job. So whoever put the motor in, they just take the hood off or whatever. And uh, or if they know how to do it without taking the hood off, just take the hood off or whatever, and then they can drop the motor in like that. So, uh, waiting for the slow down, man. It's time to pick this shit back up. It's time to get back on the ball, on the ball. We done sat down, we done had fun. So, let's get back to work. I'm gonna catch y'all in a minute. Peace. A few moments later. So, so I done made it back to the house, man. Let me see if I can get this gas put off in here real quick. Let me move this out the way. Been on the phone this morning. Uh, 
with my guy at um QA1. So uh y'all stay tuned. We got major stuff going on with QA1 this year too. Um I ain't trying to spill the beans just yet, but uh we probably got a lot of shit coming for this donk. You know what I'm saying? Now I'm gonna have to get some shit for this since I'm starting on this now too. So um y'all definitely stay tuned because uh, we not playing no game. Let me put this gas off in here real quick, man. That was mine in the garage. All this stuff gonna be gone shortly. Hopefully it's just the gas, bro. I ain't gonna cap, man. Hopefully it's just the gas so I can crank this joint up. I supposed to be going to take my dude to get an oil chain. Waiting on Carter to hit me up to bring the Corvette. I ain't gonna lie, y'all. I'm, I'm down there back excited because I'm back doing some shit. And I ain't gonna lie, man. This one, of my, this my my ultimate dream car. It's uh. Oh shit. It can't be that much gas in there. Oh, that means there's something else if this joint ain't cranking. If the gas coming back out. Unless I was pointing too fast or something. Oh shoot. Dang. So it can't be the gas. $20. So I know this joint can't be full. Damn, I just rubbed it on me. Shit. Damn, man. So this joint probably ain't gonna start unless I post some gas in the car plane because the gas coming back out on me. Figure this out. Let me go get the keys to it. That's crazy, bro. That's literally crazy. I just got off the uh, the phone with the guy, and uh, he's just going over the prices and everything. I gave him the video, gave him detailed description of everything that I wanted, and uh, he gave me a price, bro, that I really can't refuse. You feel me? So uh, we're gonna get this joint to him immediately. I ain't gonna cap to you. So uh, let me run in here and get this. All right, let me see if I can get some motion out of this motherfucker. I can't get no motion. This gonna be slow motion. Man. I can't get no motion. This gonna be slow Crazy. 
<laughs> it ain't been crunking so long. I'm gonna let it run and charge itself up for a little minute. Golly, bro. <laughs> that junk just needed gas. I knew it was something, bro. I knew it was something. I knew it was something. Come on, man. Y'all heard? Man, the colors do run now. It's smoothed out now. We got that thing back running and driving, bro. Man, we got two birds that run and drive, man. Now we just gotta get that mug. Well, I can't say that because I told that one apart. It ran and drive, drove more than these. <laughs> I had it the longest, and that was a running and driving car when I first got it. So, um, if y'all don't know the story behind that car, let me, I'm gonna let this run for a little minute. But, um, let me. Let me go pop it. I'm gonna let this joint run a little bit. Get them uh, juices flowing back in it. From sitting up so long. Get the juices back in it. Damn. It's that kind of close, close. Yeah, so, if y'all don't know the back story behind this, and if somebody no, nah, because I think if I get a grill, it's going to cover that in a way. Yeah, if I get a grill, it's going to cover this in a way. I was going to ask if somebody had one um, that they can ship to me. But um, my Tierra grill is going to be able to go over this. But the back story behind Nelson, guys, is um, I was taking Nelson apart, doing the frame off. Well, not doing the frame off. I wasn't at first. Uh, but the... the I had to drop this one out to a shop about a, uh, two and a half years ago, almost three years ago, and I took it there to get floor pans, then I told them just give me a tune-up, new distributor, all that type stuff, you know what I'm saying, go through it, if there's anything within the motor that need fixing, go ahead and fix everything, you know what I'm saying, because I was going to get that motor and transmission away, and so after that... Uh, you know, I put the QA1, I put the UMI performance, I put the Wheelwood brake system, everything on it. I don't know if y'all can see it, but yeah, I did everything up under there brand new. As y'all see the Wheelwood master cylinder and stuff, so I got six piston Wheelwood brakes on here, and I got all the QA1 stuff for the rear, and so... You know, I was just supposed to take the motor out. I'm putting the dropping the supercharged motor. Well, I'm gonna make this my pro charge. This is my, gonna be my pro charge car. Cause I wanna hear that whoosh. So this is gonna be my all pro charge car. And so I got the busting it down. You know, I removed the um the AC part because I'm gonna put vintage air in there. If y'all see I got the whole full dash out right there. Got the whole full dash out. Um 28s for it. It won't be those wheels. It's gonna be some other wheels, so I'm gonna take them um, faces off and I'm gonna put new faces on. So we're gonna get some new wheels uh, made from MTW Billet for the colors, uh, cause they wanna work with me on, on this colors and that colors. I think they wanna build me some wheels for that colors. But I'm thinking about going with some 26 inch wheels from Billet Specialties for that colors. I don't know, man. Uh, I gotta look at their designs. I I seen this one design that I like so much that make it look still like a muscle car. And that's the reason kind of why I want to go with them. But um, yeah, man, I had did this car all the way up. Um, from the suspension and everything, man. And the guy let my car sit out there for two years just wiring up these um headlights. Like two years to wire up some headlights and to do a tune-up. Like, I'm, I, I don't know what people be thinking, man. So I finally had put the pressure on the guy to get my shit done, and he still lollygagged around, man. So I just went and picked up my shit, and I was like, bro, I'm done with you. And I went and got my stuff. 
And so I start busting it down on my own. And that's how I end up being like this. That's why all the doors off, as you see right here. That's why the front clip off, this whole fender clip and everything comes off. I can take it off right now. And the only thing I got left is to take the um, motor up out of there and lift the body off the frame where I got to cut out the brake line. I got to cut the brake lines, cut the um, the fuel lines and stuff like that. And then I'm just going to lift it up. I got to drop the gas tank or whatever, but I'm going to lift it up and I'm just going to roll the whole frame up out of here. And then once I get done with the frame, I'm going to put the motor and everything on top of it. Then I'm going to bring it back to the house and I'm going to roll it back up under. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, yeah. And then take it off and I'm going to get everything done that way. So, it ain't going to be easy, but we're going to get it done. We're definitely going to get it done. Rewiring the whole car. So, what y'all see right there is all the wires. I took all the wires out of here. All the wires. All the wires. I broke all the wires out. Took them all off. And that's that on that. Um, some of the ends and stuff. That shit should come with the new one. So, yeah. But that's the story on this one, man. But this one is going to be tucking 28 by 11s on here. With a 7 inch lip in the rear. So it's going to be tucking. So y'all stay tuned for that content, bro. I'm coming up, uh, bro. I'm showing out this year, bro. I ain't gonna cap to you. But um, yeah, man. We got this one warmed up. You know what I'm saying? To where it's just gonna fire right back up. Now I can cut this joint off. But yeah, the top works still. Everything works. But like I said, I want to get everything redone. I got. I want to get the top redone. Cause it's still a good frame on this top, I ain't gonna lie. Still a good frame, I just gotta fix this front part, so. However they fix it, they fix it. If not, I'm gonna get a new one. It is what it is. But, uh, yeah, cut that thing off, hold on. I don't think this worked. I think the radio was on when I bought it, I don't know. I probably didn't plug up the wires and stuff back. But it's all good, that's my wing. That's for the wing for the trunk for this car. And now, since I'm finna send it off to the paint shop, I'm finna go in here uh, tonight and I'm finna order my hood. Gonna get that on this way. So I can have that hood before I take it to the paint shop. Man, I'm just so glad that it crumped back up. Now I can move the car in and out the garage when I feel like it. Now, the people that's at the paint shop don't have to worry about a car not running and driving. And <laughs> now we got a running and driving car, man. I ain't gonna lie, I'm back excited now. Um, yesterday, I ain't gonna lie, yesterday, bro, I went through a real, real bad depression moment. I don't know what it was. It just hit me out of nowhere. Like, I just was so depressed. I don't know what it was, you know? But I think when I mess with these cars, bro, when I mess with these cars, bro, it make everything go away, bro. So if y'all going through anything, y'all going through stress, y'all going through depression, bro, that shit is real. And I'm here for y'all, bro, because I go through it a lot. But, man, shit, bro. That just mean I just got to get back to my real grind. When I'm on my real grind, can't shit slow me down or stop me, bro. I be so excited about life. And I'm just ready to get out to these shows, man. I'm ready to get with some people behind me. The dude that's gonna paint my car, I'ma let him paint this one. And I'ma let him paint this one. The don't too. So, man, we got some shit up our sleeve, man. You feel me? Gotta take them off and put them back over there on the top of that one. Cause we gotta get y'all off there. These are the seats to the cutlass. The back seats. I kept them because I'm just gonna reimpost the back seats. And I'ma um I got the CTSV seats for that one. If y'all see right there, CTSV seats. I'm going to take the headrest off or whatever. But, I mean, hopefully I can get them to sit down in there. I'm tall, so, you know, it don't really matter to me. But I don't want the seats up so high. But if I have to, then I have to. Uh, if I got to shorten the frame, I'll shorten the frame with the seats. Because the seat, seat is a pretty high seat. You know what I'm saying? So, as y'all see right there, 
that seat is a pretty high seat and I don't know how well it's gonna fit um, inside of there. But I think these electrical seats, I think they electric. That's where the seat belt go. Yeah, they electric right here. So, uh, hopefully I can get them to work and I ain't gotta keep trying to uh, buy seats and stuff like that, so. Yeah, man, we got a lot of work to do with that one. See, that one all good it out. All good it out. So, I'm telling y'all, bro, like, I'm, I'm back excited now. Just after talking to the painter guy, he know the type quality I'm looking for. He know when I say a price, I mean, when he say a price, that I'm getting all the works. You feel me? So, I ain't gonna cap to you. Like I told him, he got a 30-day turnaround period, too. I told him I don't want that 30-day turnaround period just because I gotta build this dome. So I want them to put they all into this car. You know what I'm saying? He told me the time frame that they build their cars and the time frame that it is to get them out. So, you know, I just stick with that time frame. But at the same time, I'll be building this dome. So I don't want him to rush on this and then I don't want to get no rush work. So I want him to take his time, do it right. That's it, you feel me? and we can go on with the next. So um, let me go get ready and we finna get ready and take this Corvette over there to Carter. But uh, I appreciate y'all, man. Get y'all tickets for the CA Corvette too. We finna take that thing and get beamed up. Cause we got a big Corvette show that we're going to this weekend. So y'all stay tuned, peace. All right, y'all, man, your boy has made it inside the giveaway Corvette. Uh, we about to take this joint up here to Carter Care so he can get this joint all the way right. He gonna fully detail this joint inside and out. So when I pull in to the show, we gonna be looking up the park. You feel me? But this joint don't do number six, you guys. And honestly, that's the only reason I'm getting rid of this car. Cause, bro, I don't drive this car. This car is a 2020, only have 19,000 miles on it. Um, the car just sits, man. So I really want somebody to get out there and really enjoy it. And, um, you know, just take care of my baby, you feel me? I don't care what you do with it, but at least just take care of it. I don't want to see it run down if y'all do keep it, like when I come out the show, but I'm pretty sure y'all will take care of it, man. It's a, it's, a, it's a Corvette, and it's a nice Corvette at that, so. Um, but yeah, man, inside, still brand new in here. Like I told you guys, a lot of people um, don't know that I got the actual carbon fiber package. So it's a 3LT, fully loaded, fully optioned out. Got the rear view, reverse mirror. That's actually a TV screen. It's not the actual, well, it's a back mirror, but it's a TV. You know what I'm saying? So I can see everything behind me. When y'all can't see me, I can see you. You feel me? Got the carbon fiber on the seats. Got the carbon fiber on the doors. Bose system, as y'all see, Bose system in here. You know, it's just an all around good car. Gotta put some air in it because I ain't been driving it, so it's been sitting up, so I need to put some air in the tires. But yeah, y'all see, man, everything's still new in here. Still new. You feel me? Got that motor in the rear, and this is what we got that a lot of people don't be having. We got that, uh, that glass up there where you see the sky, you feel me? You know what I'm saying? So, uh, yeah, and we got the custom wheels. You know what I'm saying? First one to put these wheels on a Corvette, period. You know what I'm saying? C8, you know what I'm saying, with the ECL wheels. And we got the, the custom wrap on here. Y'all know my door jams is wrap. Yeah, we did it the right way. We don't. You know what I'm saying? We don't shortcut nothing. We do it the right way, you feel me? So yeah, we got the door jams done. Full color change on this thing, man. And if y'all don't know, we do got the carbon fiber in the front, I mean not front, but the actual hood area as the trunk, we got that up in, uh, on top of the motor. So we got the carbon fiber package on top of the motor too. That's what you ain't gonna see in a lot of other people Corvettes either, is we have that carbon fiber on top of the motor that came from factory with the car. 
So I told you, we, we fully optioned out. Like when I picked this car, I picked the right car. That's why I paid so much for it. I picked the right car to get. So yeah, man. Um, but like I say, we headed up here to Carter Care right now so he can take care of everything. And um, I'm gonna catch you guys in a minute, man. I'm so excited about my cars right now. Y'all don't even understand, man, but um, we definitely getting through it. And it's definitely been a journey with this car. And, you know, I appreciate everything and every support that it brought me along the way. And we just finna do bigger and better things. So y'all stay tuned, man. This year finna get crazy and ugly. Yes, sir, Ski, you feel me? Oh, we made it up here. I got Carter, Carter Care Detailing. Way do wraps and everything. My boy, man, I thought I was going to be here with you. I think I came a little further than you was. That traffic killed me. Yeah, that traffic killed me, golly. Ain't this the one you wrapped, ain't it? Yeah, but y'all, man, we, uh, um, oh, no, that front tire is low. It's only one. But now nah, they ain't low. The rest of them ain't. That, that front one right there is. But I do got a, um, I got a what you call in the front. One of those little air pumps. Okay. It don't look like it's low, but it's a 23%. But yeah, y'all, man, we'd have made it up here to Miami. I got car to car care. Uh, car de car care detailing. Car is car care. Okay. No, because I looked, I was searching it up and I put that in on Google and it was called bringing up something else. Because I was trying to see how to get here from my house that I stay somewhere else. So it was coming up as uh, car to car care detailing or car to care detailers or something. I don't know. It's something long. It's different. Hey. <laughs> yeah, it's it's, it's different. It is. It's just different. That's my shit. It's, it's, different. it's different. So, uh, y'all, man, this one of the raps he had did on his um uh, uh, for his CLZ Customs. Custom. CLZ, CLZ Customs, you guys. So, if y'all don't know, he actually rap cars. So, what we about to do? I uh, didn't tell you guys, but I'm about to do a surprise rap. Well, it ain't gonna be no surprise rap no more once she noticed her car gone for a long, for a little period. No video. Yeah, I mean, but she don't watch my videos. She don't watch your videos? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> well, she, she into cars, but she ain't into them like that. But she don't watch your videos? No. Nah. She used to. She used to. But she stopped watching once she... She don't like seeing a lot of girls in my video. Ah, so she was like, uh, I, I'd rather not just watch. Yeah. Because, I mean, you know, content is content. So when I started doing those little gold digger pranks, yeah. she was like, no, nah, I ain't going to watch. Because she was just trying to let me make my money. But, you know, it was actually the other people that were so mad more than her. Yeah. She, she didn't give two fucks about it because she knew I was going to make the bread off of it. Yeah. But the subscriber was more mad than she was. So okay. it is what it is. So I just stopped doing them. But uh, as y'all see right now, this one of his um, trucks that he had did, well, not his truck, but this one of his rap jobs that he had did, if y'all see, man, he actually do a really, really good job, and he pays attention to that detail on it like crazy. Like, if y'all see it, like, it's, it's fire. And so I came up with the conclusion to go ahead and let him do a rap on my, my wife's car, so... Um, I know she don't watch my videos as I was just explaining to him uh, So she won't never know but uh, he actually man took this whole truck apart and put it back together And I'm not gonna lie to you man. He went crazy on this with the gloss black Like he takes the whole thing apart like he don't bull crap around He takes everything off that he needs to and he actually cleans everything to a perfection before he actually wraps the vehicle so Man, as y'all see, man, he definitely did his one-two on it. Definitely did. And this don't brand new, and he brought it straight to him. Look at the inside, and y'all think why I want a new dually. Look at all the carbon fiber stuff. Come on, man. He went nuts. It's no comparison, man. What the Laramie is compared to those other vehicles, bro. Crazy. But yeah, so that's what we're gonna do. 
we're gonna get him to wrap it. I'm up here today to go ahead and pay for the wrap and everything and get that thing done. Get my wife's on knocked out, man, because her birthday is coming up soon. And you know, I gotta have something. I can't be empty handed. See, he takes everything off, man. All the trim, everything. He takes it all up. You feel me? Yes, yeah, Sersky. Yes, yeah, Sersky. Yes, yeah, sir. Yeah, he definitely got this joint together. Yes, yeah, Sersky. Got anything you want to say, my boy? Ah! <laughs> I got your boy, man. It's your boy, 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 it's Come on now, you already know what it is. And then you know I'm doing the giveaway on it, so we can't have that joint all dirty and looking like this. Come on now. I can't believe you give this joint away, bro. I know, bro. It's crazy. Away too many clean ass cars. I know, but that's what I'm known for now. So I'm gonna right. keep that up since right. you know it's just like when you do a good good rap job and you do another one and you yeah, do another yeah. one. Hey, shit, hey. Cause look, I think you just gave away what, 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 the money uh, Carlo. The the colors. The colors. Yep. The colors. Yep. Damn, yeah, bro. I ain't supposed to get that one away, but since I had came across that donk, I was like, man, forget oh, it, scratch yeah, this. Yeah. I gotta get rid of this one, like, it, cause I like my old schools in the garage and I ain't have no space for the cutters. Uh, if I had enough space, then I would have just kept it. I was, I was thinking about that. I was thinking like, when you said you keep this yep. outside, I'm like, why you keep this outside? But you keep the old schools. The old the schools, car. I like old schools better than the new car. Maybe. I don't care how much it costs. If I get a McLaren, that bitch gonna sit outside. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> It is what it is, bro. Damn. Hey, man, it's just something about me. My first car was an old school, so I look at old schools more better than new cars, bro. Right. New car, you can replace them. If somebody steal it, oh, well. Yeah, old school. Them I get my money back. back. Yeah, the old school is way more valuable, and you can't get that money back like that. Yeah. You know, I mean, but you do got people that got good insurance companies out there now um, that actually know the value of them. So you actually do. But I'm not trying to build a car over. Wow. I can build another Corvette over. I can buy another McLaren yeah. over or a Huracan, yeah, yeah, yeah. Liberty, whatever. You, you know, can't, you, you can't, can't just build, really. No, you, you can't know, build that exact car back like it was. Nah, right. nah. It, and you know, the headaches we go through building them cars. Yeah. I ain't going through that no I double time. <laughs> Hell no. Nah. Heck no. Nah. But y'all see, man, he about to get ready and watch this joint up, too. Y'all know if y'all need that detailing, that paint correction, that PPF, everything. The ceramic coating, all that. Take the tent off here and put And tent, you know what I'm saying? Tent, too. Yeah. Yeah, man. Dang. Dang, my boy, that tent look a little bad, my boy. For real? But they be, they be still want you to uh, watch their work trucks and stuff. Because I guess, you know, they, they probably want to go out in it on a weekend and then go back to work. They ain't finna go, look at this. They finna go back to work, huh? <laughs> oh, dang. It's a work Oh, well, ain't nobody work finna do that. That's from a forklift. Call it putting stuff in, and then it's, it's, it's hitting it. Yeah. Now, I'll hear it. I'll hear it. Oh, yeah. This is a real work truck. Yeah, that's all forklift damage. Yeah. <laughs> you see, you see, you got the drill some ice and all this stuff right here, like, you know what I'm saying? Uh-huh. It's a real work truck. That thing dusty in the inside. Shoe yeah. prints, man, all that. Oh, I was going to say, um, do the inside, too, because, I I, I, yeah, because one day it was cracked and um, the dirt was flying in. Ooh. So it got dust on no, the side? I mean, it's it's dust, but it ain't it ain't like no no okay. crazy dirt type. I hurry up and closed it once that truck was coming through with the damn dirt. Oh, oh you got the key. <laughs> yeah. But now nah, you know you know how the, the dash just get a little dusty. Okay. So it it ain't no no dirt or nothing. I know, but you know that truck came through and slung that yeah. shit up. I was like, "Fuck!" I left my window down to hurry up and so I caught it. It ain't like it just went crazy, but it's just a little dusty. Nah, I got you, bro. 
Yeah, man. So, and, and then that's that orange dirt. So yeah, that, that shit is like, yeah. man, I'm like, come on. Yeah, bro. It's, it's like the damn, it, it, it made it feel like the way that powder coat did. It do feel like that. Yeah. It do feel so, like that. But it's gonna come off though. <laughs> yeah, it's gonna come off. We ain't that that wasn't yeah. coming off. <laughs> yeah, and then I ain't know um the 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 engine, bro. You know I ain't never even cleaned the engine part. The engine? No. I can know it. Oh, okay. You know, just add it to the tail. I, I was like, I just wanted, you know, I wanted back to where it new. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. I th what's up in here? Let me see. It's probably a car cover up in there. Cause I don't think I took it out. Okay, yeah, that's the only thing in there. Yeah, cause you know, I got the carbon fibers. I said, you know, everybody at Corvettes ain't got that, so I had to show that, you know. Nah, I'm gonna get out yeah, of here. Yeah, feel me. Can this thing go up some more? Uh, I don't know. You let me know. Yeah, I guess. right there, boom. I know I had to clean too many of these damn things. Oh, yeah, to get off in that thing. Yeah. I mean, it ain't got to be everything. I was just talking about them because I know that water be coming too on them. All right. You know, I don't I don't be caring about no damn motors. Yeah. <laughs> you see the bitch clean, you be like, hey, Yeah. Man, nah, I just wanted to, I, you know, I'm giving it away, so I, you know, because you see the way the, what you call it? Uh, it was like right up there? Yeah, because yeah. you, you remember when that powder coat was on it, it... When the rain hit, it was dripping well, off in there. there. Yeah, okay. uh huh. So it's just that, and I think that's a little bit of that dirt too, still. Yeah. So it helped it stain a little bit. Well, I ain't gonna say stain, but shit, that shit everywhere. It is. God damn. damn bro. Boy, staying in a new construction area, boy, that shit is horrible. That shit horrible. But yeah, man, so y'all, we gonna. Uh, Waste no more of my guy time, man. I just want to. Huh? I don't care. Oh, you used to be having a. Uh, nah, I had a wheel run. The police, the police took that ball. <laughs> Hell yeah! Hell yeah! They say you better be glad it was me, cause I ain't gonna lie. If it would have been one of my partners or something, they would have took you to jail. Yeah, they know what them for. That's for people that be running for real. Yeah, so when they seen that tag, I told them instantly, hey, I just used it for YouTube purposes. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, that's it. Nah, I ain't trying to get away. I ain't. I pulled right over for you, officer. <laughs> hey, I'm good. I ain't doing nothing. I ain't got no problems with nobody. <laughs> yeah, there you go. See it. I got them right in here. And sir, you need that? Okay, I got you. I got you that too. Actually, just paid it today, sir. <laughs> hey, for real. Hey, I was not playing that day man but yeah y'all um he finna get it all together man so y'all get to see it once he done but yeah this joint is dirty down this side look more cleaner than the other side because i like i say this this side kind of be towards the cars and that side is what be out in the open so yeah. that side is a little bit dirtier than this side yeah but we got it though damn this one y'all i hate to see this one go but get y'all goddamn ticket because it's going either way <laughs> this is pressure though. I can't even lie. That wing from the accents on the back part on that on on this part down here, yeah. like bro, that shit just that shit set it off. Yeah. Uh huh. One eternity later. All right, y'all, man. So yeah, um, we about to wrap this thing up. Dang, I still forgot. I gotta take. I gotta take the scat over there and get those. I'm probably gonna do that tomorrow. Um, oh dang, I gotta go get my hair cut tomorrow. So I'll probably do that in the morning. Then go rush, go get my hair cut. All that type of stuff. So I just, I got some stuff to do tomorrow. So um, man, y'all stay tuned. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. We got the 72 colors back uh, up and running. And we're about to sip that joint off. To go get sprayed, so uh, I'm finna get down. I'm finna um, order the hood and everything now um, for it, and I'm gonna catch you guys in the next video. Y'all already know what time it is. Your boy Real to Real, hey man, say man, hey man, it's your boy man, Real to Real man. The like button, that subscribe button, that share button, go ahead and bust it down. Get y'all tickets for the 2020 Corvette C8 Corvette. Y'all already know, man. Get them tickets. Link is in the description, and I'm gonna catch y'all in the next one. Peace. Ah. She popped the sand, bitch sleepy. My coat too fast, police didn't see me.